platforms. Carriages. This is the old Metro Junction. If that's the case, then this must be the Cretan Hollow. <sighs> Good. Headset still works, and the recording function is normal. <clears throat> This is Anby Damara, a member of the Odd Job Agency, the Cunning Hairs. I accidentally fell into a companion hollow. I don't have a carrot or proxy support. Probability of getting lost in the hollow is at 96.4 per- I will be making a voice log of my experience. Let it serve as evidence for future investigation in the case I am killed or turned into a monster by the ether. Anby's hollow survival log number one. From my surroundings, I can confirm this is the old Metro Junction area of the Cretan Hollow. The Metro Hollow's terrain is inherently complex. My chances of being rescued will be reduced by 37.8% if I don't consider my next step carefully. If anyone doubts the nature of the Hollow's spatial distortions, please use my recording as proof of their danger. Please don't enter a Hollow unless you are a professional investigator. Otherwise... Uh, there you are, Envy! Great! I knew you'd be okay! Whoa! What's gotten into you? You almost got me. I've met another being of reason. He looks a lot like my colleague, Billy Kidd. <laughs> what are you talking about? It's me, Billy. An investigator has previously encountered ethereals who can mimic human speech and behavior. The investigator rescued the ethereal pretending to be their teammate, but once they got out of the hollow, it revealed itself. The city made a huge sacrifice, but it was unable to defeat the monster. It was only thanks to a courageous investigator who gave his life to drive the monster back into the hollow that the danger was averted. Come on, the ethereal would be done for the minute it left the hollow. Wait, isn't that the plot of that movie that was in theaters not long ago? There was a long list of victims involved in the incident. I read all- That's called a cast list! Question, who would you most like to have dinner with? Huh? Dinner? <laughs> of course. That'd be the big screen superheroes! <laughs> the Starlight Knights! Wait, wait, wait! Put your blade down! I'll tell you! <sighs> it's really the late night drama actress from... Oh, sweetie... Monica... All clear. The individual has been confirmed as the real Billy Kid. Meeting Billy Kid increases my chances of survival by over 67.8%. I'm glad you're okay, but- I told you I'm me! It's been a while since we fell. Nicole must be trying to come up with a way to get us out from the outside. But will she be willing to pay for the help? You know how Nicole is. <laughs> Based on Nicole's tight-fisted spending habits, I'd say your original analysis is likely correct. Damn, now you've got me worried. Let's not get carried away. We have to work together as usual. You take the front and I'll provide fire support from behind. Right.
Starlight! Shine bright! Sorry, it's nothing personal. We're regular people. You're monsters. We're destined to be enemies. I'll aim for your weak spot. It won't hurt. Huh? Uh oh! They forgot to reload! Okay, buddy, wait a sec! Time out! Oh! Stay focused. <laughs> Whoopsie daisy! Wait, who's that over there? <sighs> the strong box is right at his feet. You're right! Awesome! Saves us the hassle of searching for it. Slow down, Ambi. What are you gonna do? Catch him, then recover the strong box. Just wait. I never destroy all! Yep, looks like ether corruption. This mutation is so intense. I don't think this guy has any ether aptitude at all. His consciousness is still holding on. It's too late. Ether crystals are forming all over his body. That is the core. Damn it. He's almost completely mutated. This guy's a tough one. Roger that. Returning now to 14th Street, where an explosion occurred on one of the upper floors of a residential building shortly after the appearance of a companion hollow. According to our sources, the explosion was set off by public security in their operation against the violent Red Fang Gang. Public security took extreme measures, including the use of Air Force weaponry. The leader of the Red Fang Gang is thought to have fallen into the hollow and is yet to be brought to justice. The head of the bomb squad is on the way. Please, stay away from 14th Street. Hey! Listen up! I was there when that explosion took place! This is an emergency! Billy, Anvi, and the target of my commission have fallen into that hollow. I need a proxy's help now! Hello, Nicole. It'd be nice of you to knock next time. I feel like I hear of your urgent needs at least three times a month, Nicole. You can make fun of me all you want after you help me deal with this crisis. Oh, 
Please, legendary proxy Faithin. What, what trouble, trouble did, did you, you get, get yourself, yourself into, into this time? time? I just checked. Doesn't look like there's anyone suspicious outside. Don't worry, I wasn't followed. It took a lot to get out of 14th Street unnoticed, but I made sure nobody was tailing me. I hope so. I know things been tight lately with the general election just around the corner. They're really cracking down on proxies. They set up a hotline and... Okay, Nicole, as long as you get it. We can get down to business. I need you for an important commission, with pay. So Billy and Ambi fell into a hollow. I have to get them out. And I need to get back what I've been commissioned to deliver. Why don't you make a rescue application with the Hollow Investigative Association? I don't want to make us a target for the association right now. If they and it'd take a small fortune to pay those greedy vultures off. But I can't just abandon my squad, right? Leaving employees behind. That does sound a lot like Nicole's style. Hey, don't be mean. I allocate a large portion of our revenue to the employee rescue budget. Look, all in all, my request is simple. All you need to worry about is getting my people and my client stuff. You don't accept basic proxy work now? Finish this job, and I'll clear my entire bill in one go. You've been dodging your bill for months, Nicole. You should think about the interest. Fine. I'll give you a share of the commission payment. Does that cover it? <laughs> That'll do it. Great. There's no time to waste. I'll be waiting for you in the hollow. Uh -uh. Nicole, are you hurt? You should stay and rest a while before heading back out. But... Uh, just listen to my brother. We'll also need your help to take Eo somewhere close to the hollow later. Oh... Deploying your bang boo double, huh? Bro, how about you tend to Nicole's wound first? I'll go debug the HDD and help you with the prep work to infiltrate the hollow. Well then, let's get down to business. Can you hear me, Nicole? Hey, you can put Eos through now. Okay. Right, little one. Off you go, then. <laughs> Done. Bang Boo's on the way. <laughs> so... Can we start it up? Hey! 
the rate my ammo's depleting, I can say goodbye to my efficiency bonus. Incoming, get ready. <laughs> wait, 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 that wasn't me! Hey, all, over here. Nice work, all. It's a scarf wearing talking bamboo. Oh! You're Faithin! I can't hear that superior ethereal anymore. <sighs> Great. I propose now is a good time to take a break. Is that acceptable, Proxy? You all rest. Thanks, Proxy. Whew! That was dangerous. It's crazy what a powerful monster that Red Fang dude mutated into. It's all thanks to you, Manager! As expected from Faithin! You flatter me. I'm just doing what any proxy does. I figured to save money, Nicole would have left us to fend for ourselves. Hiring the great Faithin to get us out is quite a surprise. If you hadn't come, I'm afraid we wouldn't have made it out of that Ethereal's territory. Thanks for coming to the rescue. Speaking of which... I've always wanted to ask you about that device in your store. You know, the one that lets you sync with Bang Boo and communicate in real time within Hollow. That's some serious tech. Even public security and the Hollow Investigative Association can't do it. With a trump card like that, why didn't you just join the association? Whatever way you look at it, working with us Hollow Raiders. Ha that sounds like an ethereal. Ugh, so soon? I only just sat down. We have to get out of here. Unless, Billy, you'd like to stay here forever? That new Starlight Night Belt you wanted. I guess I'll place it at your grave next year. When you say things like that with that poker face of yours, I can't tell if you're joking or not. Let's get moving. Follow me. Leave any combat alone. <laughs> you just focus on leading the way. Of course. I've located the closest exit. Take the path on the right, Wise. Please, manager, lead the way. Come on. Let me scan the upcoming area. Fortunately, there are no ethereals on our tail. Let's keep pushing to the exit. Hello, observation data. The more, the better. Please, manager, lead the way. Let's switch, Ambi. Your guard down. Copy 
Shaking. Ethereals. They're catching up, Proxy. What should we do? Fight. It's cool. Just come with me. This track lane machine. We can use this. It'll be faster if we keep to the track. Scanning for safety valve data. The system log shows that the valve... Agent Billy detected. He is forcing the valve lock. Valve detected. Open. But Agent Billy has suffered partial damage. Ow! It hurts! Feel the 
This race should be good. Full speed ahead. Understood. Full speed ahead. Wait, ahead? But that's a wall in front of us. Smash it? You want to smash through it? I don't have that kind of firepower right now. Don't worry. Just do what my brother says. That voice. Oh, it's the other Phaethon! You're finally online. Sorry, I was checking to make sure the hollow exit was stable. Billy, Anby, can you hear me? Do you know space inside the hollows is totally distorted? That means... A way out may look like a dead end. But a dead end may also just be a dead end. Thanks for the explanation. Our escape route after getting out has been arranged. You can trust us. Hey, bro, you can cut the connection. See you at the store. Good luck, you two. It's gone quiet. It became a regular. Why would they desync at a time like that? Going straight forward. Price for impact. We're gonna crash. We're gonna crash. We're... The oppressive weight of ether is gone. <sighs> We're out. <laughs> Faith and got the time and locations. Hey, you two! Get in the car! <laughs> Boss! You're here! Perfect timing! Honestly, Nicole, we've been waiting for quite a while. That wasn't fast enough? I put my foot down through every normal R255 green mutt. Oh, right. I made sure I wasn't followed the whole way. Anby, what does an R255 green light look like? It's the same color as your jacket. Nicole, they've both been extracted. I guess it's time to... Not so fast. That's not what we agreed on. The commission was my people and the client's item. You've only completed the first half. Don't worry, Nicole. We remember. It's just a joke. I knew Faithen was the most reliable and trustworthy. According to what we saw before extraction, the strongbox should be in the territory of a highly dangerous... The White Star Institute has it registered as Dullahan, a superior ethereal. That's the one. That Red Fang dude was unlucky. His ether corruption must have been pretty intense. And Andy and I tried to grab the strong box, but that guy was so tough. What exactly is in that box? Is it worth all this effort? Mm -hmm. We'll find out soon enough. <laughs> Take a look at this. So it looks like a necklace, but it's actually a flash drive? That's right! It's a mini storage device. It's Silver's. I picked it up in the building before I got out of 14th Street. I noticed it before. He always had it on his person, so it must contain something important. <laughs> I bet it has something to do with a strong box. But it suffered some damage. Yeah, look at all those burn marks. Faithen, can you do some of your mm, magic using that complicated computer of yours? The HDD is mainly used to process hollow data. But if we only need to export what's in the flash drive. <gasps> hey, bro, maybe I could try to recover the data with the proxy network's computing power. Great, it's a deal then. We'll try to locate the strong box in the hollow. We'll come find you when we learn something new. Let's just go our separate ways until then. Oh, don't forget to extract the data from the flash drive, though. See ya, manager. Goodbye.
Ready for combat. Ah, Wise, you're here! Perfect timing. My boss says I'll need your help with something. What is it? He wanted the message to be delivered verbatim, so here it is. <clears throat> I found a new way to source awesome new gadgets. I'm sure you'll like them. If you're willing to help, they should be available in the store soon. You sound just like your boss. Wait, I'm not finished yet. <clears throat> this new path is blocked and I've lost communication with the assistant I sent there. Could you help me sort it all out? I'll send more details soon. That's it. Everything my boss said. I see. There's something wrong with the gadget store's underground W engine business. A batch of goods must have fallen into- I'm not sure exactly what happened, but it sounds like there was a problem with the gadgets they call W engines. Aren't they the ones you and your friends are collecting? Since it's such an urgent request, Boss said that apart from the regular payment, I can also give you a sample as a thank you gift. Wait, this texture, this batch of goods must be- The latest W engine equipped with the fourth generation synchronous conduction device. It can release ultrasonic waves that effectively resonate with the active wavelengths of various ether weapons. According to official data, the average initial weapon performance can be improved by up to 44.21%, and the combat survival rate of personnel equipped with such gear can be increased by at least 30%. Anby? What are you doing here? Keep it down. Susie may be working here, but she has no idea W engines are weapons. Better not say stuff like that in front- Huh? Ultrasonic waves? Weapon performance? It's nothing. We're just talking about a game. 
You probably didn't know that, Susie, but you can use W engines to play board games, where each W engine has different stats assigned. Oh, is it similar to playing pool? W engines are round after all. Guys, hang on a sec. The boss just texted me, and he has a message he wants me to share with you. Looks like I found a connoisseur. Good gadgets truly shine in the hands of someone like you. If you purchase one when the shipment arrives, I'll give you an exclusive customization. Whoa, who would have thought the boss would get involved in- Thanks, but there's no need. I do want to buy a new W engine, but even with the account balances of the three of us cutting hairs combined, we wouldn't be able to afford the latest model. I just so happen to have one on hand. It's a thank you gift from the boss. Since it won't be of any use to me, you can have it. Really? This will make dealing with that superior thi- I mean, player, a lot easier. Oh? It sounds like you're planning to meet other W Engine players? Don't worry, with the boss's skillful customization, you'll be sure to leave a lasting impression. Just hold on a sec. Sorry to keep you waiting. The gifted sample has been modified. Yeah. I like this design. I'm happy you like it. I hope it serves you well. Thank you. And the boss, too. I'll treasure it. Standing by. Standing by. 